come out. It feels like a reunion almost. They you cause, man. What's your next magic trick? Tell me. What's the I'm next I'm telling you, man. I'm, I'm not getting any of the cut of the venue. <laughs> People out here accusing me, bro. I, I accuse you at least maybe like 30% of the take tonight. At least tonight. I, I mean, don't know if about everybody tonight. If I, if I got a dollar per person to enter, I would have made a quick bill right there. Yeah, that would have be been a nice bill. It would have been a very nice <laughs> bill. Anyways, I mean, you know who's making a pretty good bill here is boy with his grab combos already putting Larry off the sides, man. If I, if I saw a corner carry, this would have been it. You know what's so important, too? Like, Boyd's Arsene was... <laughs> wow. Boyd's Arsene was about to <laughs> pop, and then he just turn, turned up. Like Yeah, he did. Now he's got Arsene for the second stock. Going to try to get as much damage as he can. Larry trying to go for the two-frame, but keeping the pressure up. Yeah, Arsene is like a good roommate, man. He knows when he can you out of the trouble, and he knows when you're in it. Larry's been in full control after this Arsene. Finally, Boyd getting a neutral rate, getting some kind of damage before this Arsene fades away. Wow, that back here is so close. Up smash, still not enough. Joker is too damn heavy. He's so yeah. heavy. This is Pokemon Stadium. He lived that. This man has strides weight, but he's heavy. I don't understand it. Crazy, dude. Good up smash out of the spot dodge. Pretty good opportunity here, especially the second time you saw Boy kind of cross him up after that one. That Joker is heavier than Wolf. That ain't right. <laughs> that ain't right. There's a lot of things that ain't right in this world, man. <laughs> That's one of them. Yeah. Maybe in 2020 we might see a new uh, weight class to Joker here, but immediately what we will see here is Larry go for the double dash back. Yeah, that was nice. You guys can tell I'm a, I'm a wolf man, you know what I'm saying? But Larry, okay, so here comes Arsene, but Larry is in control. The down smash, not going to connect, but right into the nair. He just knows that Void wants to go right into the jump after. I like the fade back on that second nair as well to kind of position for ledge roll. Larry just one of the best when it comes to ledge trapping. Yeah. Oh, immediately no opportunity for Larry after the nair. Void will shut that down with the forward smash. I did like how Void kind of came up with the downward guns because of that opportunity, like you said, right? Larry was looking to position himself with the neutral air. At that point, right, Void probably sees like, okay, I already went for a neutral air once. He wants to see me roll. I'll go for the jump opportunity here and then come back on the stage. Yeah. And then come back with a hitbox. Like, like taking aim is pretty good. But oh, that's a pretty solid option from Larry, but I don't see it going anywhere just yet. Yeah, try to catch a landing there. Usually you don't get punished like too hard um, off of like someone blocking your up be like that. And Void was able to attack on a quick dash attack here, but how is Larry going to seal out this stock right now? Void playing so evasive. That Joker dash, very, very nice because Joker is so close to the ground. And you even see Void uh, ducking there or just crouching. Still not enough. And this Arsene round two coming out, or three maybe. I'm telling you, man, Arsene's a good roommate. He knows when you need help. Yeah. Ooh, he caught the double jump there. Yeah, I like the solo. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this game. So close. Wait for it. No, oh, the invincibility. Oh my goodness! That was not fair, man. That second hitbox of the forward tilt did not even come out, man. That wasn't. That wasn't right. It's. It's okay. I mean, it's not too crazy because he just finished off with an F tilt. But can I get some justice? <laughs> can I get some justice in this game, please, man? I don't know, man. There's no. I'm seeing a lot of injustice in this world, and that was one of them. Okay, Somebody hired this man a lawyer at least. Oof. Boy trying to get all three socks with forward smash this game. MVP of the game for Boyd at this one. Looking nice mixing grim. up the timing with the jumps here, but the no back way. from Larry will actually do it. He, dude, you're you're right. This there is injustice. Okay. There is injustice. Okay, that, he's uh, he's heavy when he wants to be, and he's light when he doesn't want to be. Yeah, that, okay. I'll admit down. <laughs> that back air kind of hit. That back air kind of hit. If you get the sweet spot, immaculate spacing from Larry. But, geez, dude, he got blown back. That wasn't even close. Like, that wasn't even, like, maybe he'll live. Like, that was just, oh, you're, you're done. You're, yeah. like, super done. Pa pack it up, bro, man. I'll unplug the joystick. And we saw Larry trying to go for some of these jump reads and disadvantage like that mm -hmm. with the back air, and it finally pays off on that last talk. So we're just going to run it back straight to Pokemon Stadium. One of my favorite things about Void, like you said, right, where he kind of saw him crouch, it's kind of positioning from what he did back in Smash 4, being a Sheik main. He's so used to going for those crouching opportunities to low profile, he knows right. what that means in this game as well. We'll see how Void can handle Larry here on team too. Oh, well, Larry, of course, is the first one on the board. Yeah, and I think that's why I think Joker is still a pretty good fit for Void. So I, I hope he stays like committed to the character. Yeah. It's just like a I don't think it's it, like Joker's actually like not even that close to Sheik. Like their up airs no, are no, similar no. like That's about it, right? They got the similar up airs. But other than that, it's just a quick and nimble character, you know what I mean? Like that archetype. Yeah, exactly. The ability to whiff punish your whiff punish your opponent, the ability to have a good recovery. Those are very 
things that fit Void as a character. And like you said, I'm very interested to see how long they'll stay Joker. Oh, but that Nair was reaching extra from the right-hand oh, side. Hit him with the stubbing toe right there. That, that was sour Nair, too. That, that wasn't was even, like, hard Nair. Nair. Like, wow. Talk about an edge guard coming out from Larry. Very, very clutch here. Going to get him the lead. And big damage coming out from this forwarder into the grab. Back air. What's if Larry more? can pop this next RSM before his stock goes out, and like burn like at least half the meter, he's in such a good spot. Yeah, he will be. Unfortunately, though, Aegon will cover the ledge here and give Void an opportunity to actually come back on the stage. Wow. Last year to kind of set him to go low, but unfortunately, the down smash with no two frame. Void immediately with the forward air, but that was not even a sweet spot off the wolf flash. And yeah. Put Void wow. into the right side and the opportunity to actually get hit by that one. Larry is taking Void all the way to a 2 0 almost with no stock answered. Yeah, we'll update the score for you guys. It it, it is Larry is up 1-0. But yeah, I mean, it looks like a looks pretty promising for the 2-0. Larry is up three stocks to one. Pretty difficult. Like he's he's obviously in kill percent on this first stock, but you pretty much have to make a entire stock comeback. Oh, oh man, Larry just tried to take a soul right there. Wow, dash right attack. There into this, the dash attack. This is going to force him to go low with a down smash opportunity. I love the fact that Larry knows when to force Void to go lower or go for that back air. He knows where he wants him. The right opportunity here. Larry with the double jump there and Void with the catch the forward air. Mucha air. This brings Larry a little bit to that horizontal play, but he lands the stage first down tilt with no Nair. Really good opportunity because Nair is really good against other recoveries. Yeah. Sticking hitbox here. Now, Void will have one more Arsene to make this comeback. Yes. So th this is a pretty tough spot. And he's nowhere near it. I mean, so far doing a really good job. Maybe we'll get the gun gimps. Yes, we do. And Void is keeping himself in the match. And he's got an arson in the mm -hmm. tank. Maybe. Maybe. If he can survive. <laughs> At 126, he makes no roll cut up here. So that'll be the first step he needs to survive. Essentially, he just has to get hit without dying. Yeah, pretty much. The epitome of don't get hit. I like the fact that he doesn't even go for a, a drop down. He actually waits for Larry to see what the reaction is. Yeah. I want to say almost the no mix up mix up, but he's just pretty much letting Larry know. I won't go for the drag down just yet. I want to see you panic first. Our send pretty much activated here. Long have we waited? Void of two awaken here with the counter. Yeah, and right now our send is out. Oh, the back air. Mm, Frame track with the forward good. tilt. Void has the ledge. Wow. Did nothing, and Void with the punish there. Didn't hit him with the Joker down air. Just hit him with the Arsene down air. Very, very nice timing, and really good. Uh, I, I don't see too many Jokers do that, so nice little you know twist onto the Joker ledge trapping there. Yeah. It is pretty common to see Joker go for something like probably. I think I've seen only like the first hit of fair a couple times with the ledge, but things like take aim and I'll probably go for a backer or a ledge trump. Something that would have. Or down tilt. Or down tilt, yeah. Down tilt. I know I usually see Void go for ledge jump very reminiscent of his Sheik play back in the day. I love to see him go for that, but like I said, going for down there was the right play. And then being a high percent for Larry, you do run out of ledge a lot faster. That three to stock one comeback was insane coming out from Void. And you know what I like about that down air too? It you can almost make it look like it's a trump as well. Yes. Like the way you're jumping back into them like that. Mm -hmm. So really, really good. And Void even made it sure that he was facing inside of the stage so even if he did hit the joker dare yeah it can stage spike him and kill him exactly like so smart coming out from void and so i mean i guess this whole set's gonna be on stadium <laughs> yeah one one piece man i mean yeah. we're in the back here but in socal especially yeah and i definitely don't mind of course uh stage is very common in popularity and yeah. like the music's so fire like come on Ooh. Oh, wow, he does get the tech chase on the platform there. Larry just cashing out with a ton of damage. 31% here. Really good for a boy to kind of just run away a little bit back here. Doesn't want to approach with flash. He can little respect. He might be seeing what Larry might be going for, especially for an aerial. Forces the low recovery, but Void still comes back with a forward air. We saw him do that a couple times last game as well. Oh, wow, Larry coming in with the rogue up B there. Firewolf not going to quite hit its mark, but doesn't really get punished too hard. Another one. Okay, he might, be, he might be stretching a little hard on that. I mean, you saw Charlie do it a couple times, man. You want to give Charlie the habit. Yes, it's, it, it's definitely the, the I bet you won't, won't expect this up. Yes. And so, sometimes you got to hit, hit him with the degen stuff. <laughs> it's, it's kind of reminiscent of when Foxes in Smash 4 used to go for just regular up B at the ledge because they know, okay, you're so scared. You might right, get hit right. by this. Ooh, okay, getting shot up with the guns here. Man, this is, this is looking pretty bad because Void already on his second stock on the Arsene on the second stock as yes. well. Yes. 
No, can go here. Oh, no, no. Up tilt. Fourth throw. Larry possibly looking for an opportunity to corner carry here, and he gets it. Fade back neutral to get cover the roll, and he has enough time to go for the grab. Yeah, these up tilts not really hitting here for Void. Maybe just, like, miss input. Maybe wanted to get the turnaround. I mean, we've seen Void make the comeback, right, from last game as well. He's Fourth never throw. out. He's yeah. Never out. Yeah, especially when you got something like Arsene. The homie Arsene, man. Oh, that's a good friend, dude. Double jump bait coming out from Larry. Some people say you can walk down dark alleys with Arsene activating. You never feel scared. And definitely Void feels not, not going to feel scared at all, but he has enough time to not feel scared about that forward smash. Yeah, Larry, or uh, Void actually like committed and held the down B a little bit, but didn't hold it too long because mm -hmm. Larry would have just hold, especially with being able to hold smash attacks forever. Oh, yeah, like, you can counter your opponent's opportunity, especially when they're going for something like a Rebel, Rebel Star. Hey, Ford Tilt stretching here for Void. Still on the second stock, but man, he is at 145% still alive. He's going to get a, a second Arsene, though. This Could is really be. good for Larry, too, because usually we see him go for those fadeaway nares to kind of force the roll get up, and now we're kind of seeing him just going for Ford Tilt. See how Void reacts and then go for it. No odd tilt for Larry. Void with the ledge in control. And no side B from Larry. Void was ready for it, and the dash attack. Going to seal out that second stock. But Void at least tacked on a little bit of damage yeah. on the way out. 81 to 99 here and putting them off the stage. Oh, the dash grab. Void going to jump right up and over it with the Joker. Back here still not connecting. Larry played extremely safe. Finds his opening. Beautiful combo with the tech chase. Oh, Gets the grab. Yep. Put him off the stage here. Larry with control. Down smashing on it. He wanted it because he knew Void went low. Yep. And he's already popped this Arsene, so... Great job from Larry, and he's tacking on some damage on the way. You know what? You got Arsene, but I'm still I'm not afraid to fight you. Yeah. You do lose it. You do take damage, and that will cause the meter to go low. He's able to actually go around, take aim, hit him with back air, and put Void out of a pretty tough situation yet again. Yeah, and another thing, too, is like if you hit Arsene, you actually make it so the next Arsene comes at a later percent. Yes. You know what I mean? So it's uh, very, very important. Mm. No, I don't think the upper was opportunity. I think that might have been a miss input from Boyd. Yeah, yeah. He's using the guns to stall out as well. Really good. Larry looks like he wanted to get a position. His back door should not kill, but maybe put Boyd in a position where he can take this stock. And yeah, yes. And yes, it will be one here. One, one apiece. I thought that was Larry's last stock here, but Boyd still has a long way to go at 129. If he can clutch out like he did the last time here, that 129 will matter. Yeah, he might get another arson. Might. He's going to have to make sure he doesn't get hit by any of those kill moves from Larry. But he's got like half a meter, 136. Grab not going to kill. He did get pummeled, able to hold the shield at the ledge. That was really crucial. Doesn't want to die just after that forward tilt. Nice, going for the nair. Down throw to back air. He wants Larry off the stage. He wants to put it in edge guard. No rogue up beast for Larry yet. There's yeah. quite a couple of attempts here, but none of them sticking out just yet. That dash tag almost killed, but it didn't. So Arsene is out to play. Does he get the two frame? No, he doesn't. No. Up and over. That oh, was man. close. I, I was afraid for that man to get hit by up smash. One down air and Larry's dead. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> Come <laughs> on, Larry. <laughs> that was that, that that was the one that like, was, yeah. like the one confirm that he needed to do. And I, I mean Larry Larry knows about it, but yeah. Boyd just kinda you, you saw him not really super fishing for it right off the bat. So Mary may you know, kinda conditioning Larry like, okay, it's safe to dash under right. beat, you know what I mean? And then Boyd just right at the perfect time, perfect place, pulling the trigger, getting the confirm at sixty percent. Game three here. Sorry, game four. Loser semis here at this point. Again, I mean, Larry in a situation where he looked like he was in full control. control. Yeah. Just full control. And Boy just comes in, attacks up a little bit of damage. Wait a minute. You didn't kill me at 150, 160. You're going to have to hold this Arsene pressure. Yeah, and that's where you don't want to be at, too. One thing for Larry to understand here at game four now. Down air might be the MVP of uh, Void's moves here. It's been, it took a stock the last time, and it brought it back there for Void with a confirm. Larry might be a little bit more aware of that down air, if I were him. Yeah, honest, and I just feel like Larry is doing an incredible job, like, neutral-wise. It's just these, these offstage gun gimps are so clutch, and these Arsens. Void, Void just making these Arsens count really, really hard. Yes. So maybe yeah. Larry's got to, like, swing more harder, take more risks in certain situations, because he's... He's having to deal with Arsene because he's like not closing out the stock like sub 150 in yeah. certain situations and stuff like that. 
And there is such a thing as not taking enough risks, because sometimes you should be doing out three edge cup, but unfortunately wow. the up he will get caught by the counter there. And boy, all he knew, he knew, no man, that's the premium counter of all the counters. It will be enough to actually stick out and stop both of the recovery. Well, On stage two, man, that felt like Corrin's counter for Smash 4. Yeah, and it... Ooh, the up tilt is enough. Nice stuff from Larry. And Larry's ledge trapping has been really, really incredible, but he hasn't gotten too many down smash two frames no. on the uh, Arsene fly. The Arsene up be very, very... A lot more generous when it comes to two framing. Yeah, you do get the first 24 frames of invincibility, but when the, when the rest of it wastes out here, it will be enough for the to go for down smash. He Ooh. is setting it up there with the blaster, but it's not being able to catch it at all. Big damage coming in for Larry. Okay, nice little counter there. Oh, wow, Larry committing in. Void, Ooh, that he, hit him all the way over that hit him. He wanted Larry to feel safe to go for Nair, too. He didn't even go up there with enough, right? He didn't yeah. wait for it. He just wanted him to land on the platform. Because every single time he's been chasing it, but the one time is when he chases it up here. Void now kind of taking all the control from the first three games. Yeah, Larry's the one, and that back here center stage, not going to be enough. Now Larry the one that needs to make a comeback. Very great counter coming out from Void. Probably going to see a second Arsene unless Larry gets a really big hit here. Yeah. Down smash. I'm, I'm looking at Boyd right now. He has a lot of confidence. Good posture on the sit, on sitting down, man. He feels pretty well in hand. Yeah, this, this is just so tough because again, um, Larry getting Boyd to like that 150 mark, but you don't want to overextend with some of these moves because you don't have the stock lead, right? So you kind of have to just hold it. Yeah. Oh, the cross up saved Larry there. Oh. oh. Okay. La Larry's actually getting incredibly unlucky this day. Like. This isn't me just being a wolf main. Like that that he fell out of four tilt like four it's times. So, yeah, dude. yeah, it's four times. Like, it's not good for him. Jeez, man. <laughs> I mean Void's still playing incredibly well, but like, damn, that that sucks. Almost feels like a skill-based matchmaking might have some kind of RNG here, but uh, <laughs> we'll fire to come wow. back, but the recovery was not the one for Larry. It will be the one for Void here, and he takes and it over Larry. 3-1! It's actually crazy because if you watched, like,